Okay, we're still here in the tech lab. We're doing uh, interviews, and I've uh, been hoping to catch the WAN scatter guy, so I finally was able to catch one. We're in the booth for WAN scatter to talk about WAN optimization. So uh, go ahead and introduce yourself. Good afternoon. I'm Reggie Bush. I'm a product manager with Citrix WAN scaler, and uh, I have been uh, with this product for a very long time. Uh, I was actually part of uh, the RP data team, which Citrix acquired uh, uh, about in 2006. And I came from there, and I have been a product manager with Manscaped. All right, thank you. Good, great. So obviously, you really know what you're talking about here. So uh, the, the question I'm asking everyone is, what, what's important about this to customers? Why should they care about WAN optimization? Oh, very simple, actually. So uh, think about this. So there are a large number of your employees that are not in, 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 in the data center. They're not in headquarters, right? By some estimates, uh, about 90% of your employees access their application and the data from far away. Uh, about uh, half, I believe, are in branch offices. That's where like a third of the IT spending is. Uh, with the advent of internet access everywhere, so you have so many people telecommuting, uh, working from home, airports and stuff. So what does that mean, right? That means that your applications and your data are now being delivered up over the wide area network far and away 24 by 7. That's that's really taxing. So um, what happens is when when your when your employee is out there, uh, he or she is trying to sync their mailbox in the morning. It takes very long. It, if they're uh, they're downloading a PowerPoint file from the SharePoint site, that takes very long. They get frustrated. But that's what that's the problem that Citrix Manscaler solves uh, with Citrix Manscaler technology. That lazy land like speeds over your wide area network, your your applications run so much faster. Um, your employees are much happier, they're more productive. So you know, we hear a lot about performance problems over the WAN and you know the typical answer is to throw bandwidth at it. And I, you know, that's really painful obviously because you gotta pay that cost every single month. So WANScatter gives you the ability to stop throwing bandwidth at it. Absolutely, and there's more. So that throwing bandwidth at it actually doesn't solve the real problem. The problem is you know, packet loss in your network, right? You're going over satellite links, no matter how much bandwidth you get, there's still that that uh, 300 millisecond latency from right, um, yeah. computer to India, right? So that's a simple laws of physics. You can't split it. Yeah, you can't it. overcome the speed of light. Right, and and those are the kind of things that um, the plan scaler can help mitigate. They can it can help mitigate the the effects of large latency. Um, la Packet loss, uh, that's so that you can get over long links like this. Uh, even though they're small, your not only all, all applications are designed to operate over such large right. places and over jitter and packet loss and stuff. But that's what that's the problem. Solved. Right. So let's take a look at your demo. So, so what we what I have what we have here in this station is actually a demonstration of the Citrix Vanscaler technology and and more importantly the Citrix Vanscaler client software. So not only do we have uh, Vanscular appliances to accelerate applications between your branch and your uh, your headquarters, we also have the software client that accelerates applications to your mobile users, to remote users. The ever-growing uh, population of, of your employees who get their apps from far away. So what I have here is um, I have um, I have I have a little network set up here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to simulate that I am an uh, employee who say works from home. I'm going to open my um, it's a network file share that's actually residing in the data center. I'm going to open it up. Let's say uh, uh, I want to co I'm collaborating with an employee on a PowerPoint presentation. Right? So I'm going to download the PowerPoint presentation. Now notice how uh, how fast it was, right? So yeah, it's already done. It's already done, and uh, let me show you. So this is the, uh, the the Citrix accelerator. This is like the, the the visibility tool, the monitoring tool. The Citrix accelerator software is running on this laptop right now. What it's telling you is it, the blue line is good there. It says it's, it's accelerating. It, it's your it's accelerating the traffic. It's you're getting a very good compression ratio. Uh, let me show you. So what happens, right? For example, um, typical use case. I open this PowerPoint presentation, and I say I, I edit a slide. Let's say I delete the slide. I save it back, and let's say I even name it, right? We do. Now, let me show you what happens when I put the file back up. 
Wow, that was, that was, that was really quick. That's wow. done. So now, just to show you the amount, tremendous amount of benefit we, we provide, let me just turn this off. You don't really need to do this. This should always be running on because you want good performance. But just say I turn this off, and now you're not going to get any acceleration. But let me just show you what happens when I try to download the file without the tricks. Fan scaler. See how slow that is? Right. That's the problem we're solving. And what I have here is actually a, a simple coast to coast link that I'm simulating. It's, a, it's about 100 millisecond latency, uh, I believe about 5 mega, mega, megabyte link or so. And uh, you can see how long that took and, and how fast it was with the expenses. Can we do it one more time with the Winscator on? I'd like to watch the uh, graph as it Absolutely. sends it over. So um, what I can, uh, let, let me show you, so uh, let, let me send you another big file, let me send you the biggest file that I have. You got an 8 meg file or 9 I have, meg file. I have a PDF file here. So let me turn this on, close this and turn this on. And I open my same uh, network folder. And, uh, all right let's say I drag this from my local disk which is your desktop and I'm transferring it over the land to my that's a nine meg file over that's a nine meg file so this is a 100 millisecond link, and how how uh, what what link size are you sending? It's sending uh, it's it has about five. Uh, I believe it's uh, 100 megabit. It's a five megabit pipe oh, okay. with a 100 millisecond latency. And uh, this this is just uh, uh, the window sort of, uh, if you will, into the script uh, landscape right. client. It shows you that it, it's accelerating. Blue, blue, blue it's hard blue. to see here, but it says uh, compression ratio 1.511. One. Yes. So. You, we, not only not only did we make it go fast, it also saved saved you bandwidth. Right. So so you have uh, more you have less data going out of your WAN pipe. The response time is better. You're actually saving money as well. Um, just again, just as an example, uh, if I turn this off, and uh, I can show you how long this is going to take. It's going to take a while. Yeah, it says two minutes remaining. Yeah. All right. Thank you so much.